youngster. Got two water, kicks. Water out. Got confidence. Connects this one. Absolutely. Welcome to uh, the 77th Bramby Shield Encounter First Leg brought to you from uh, Pali Cali. Trinity College taking on Royal College here at uh, the Trinity College Rugby Stadium. Dialog Schools Rugby League Week 6 Encounter but this is so very much bigger. the school we knew the best school of all we will honor yet the rule we knew chief guest uh, being uh, introduced uh, to the players Ashan Rathwate no stranger to Dushant Leuke both of them uh, members of the Slam club uh, as Atta Bansil will uh, now introduce uh, his charges to uh, the chief guest. Today's game will be officiated by Ishanka Abegun, who kicks off proceedings and we are on in this first leg of the 76th Bradby Shield 2023. But the big Tusker forwards have it once again and here they go. Trinity will be hoping to hold them up over the line but Royal with their body positions going left then going right and now they've got space on the outside. Lovely pass off and Kalyana Ratna will score. Filio Kalyana Ratna, the man touching down in the, the far wing, made it look so very easy. The fullback is getting the first score and uh, making sure that they got uh, points for all their trouble. Absolutely brilliant stuff from the forwards to keep hold of the ball and Filio Kalyana Ratna. Nice hands from. Randul Senanayaka, the captain, making sure that he sent them overlap man over. Trinity need to desperately defend for the rest of the half if they want to go in with just a one score between the teams. Shafiq again. And looks like they might have gotten over. Yes, they have. The despairing dive of the Trinity defenders was not enough to prevent Buernik and Senanayaka from diving over for that try. It was coming, the dam had cracked and eventually it broke. Incredible work by Royal College. Discipline, Trinity put in a hardy effort, but that angle by uh, Buonica Senanaika proving it a little. The Trinity stay player back, flying back, in there. Back. It's untidy ball and Royal will want to just thump this one into touch. And the penalty is coming. You can see what that means to the Trinitians. Who really has outdone himself in terms of bravery and courage. Can he make that into a technical expertise as well? Fortunately, it's not third time lucky. And this is why I didn't agree with you gentlemen that it was the right call to take. I thought tap and run at the end of the half. Half-time confirmation. 10 points to nil. Royal College dictating terms in this first half of uh, the first leg of 76 Bradby Shield 2023. Yeah, your embrace so warm, let me stay here for a while. With one more bite of Revel O for sunshine. Of note, that uh, Steven Pereira, heavily bandaged around his head comes back into the field to kickstart the proceedings in this second half. Just took a second to recover from that. Now cover. they've got some space. Here's Jamil, manages to get the ball away. Abid Jamil. And we might have our first TMO referral. Did he knock that ball on, Sudarshana? Did he knock that ball on? We're going to have to take another look. Uh. Uh, on field decision try can you check the grounding please that ball down that corner 
seems like the corner. Oh, well. Now that's a close one. Take a look at that. It looks like he lose, lost control of the ball. Touching down here at. Here's another angle. But is there downward pressure underneath his arm? Especially given the fact that it was a try awarded by the referee. Is that conclusive evidence? The earlier shot was more, I think, was more clear for the referee. Well, there's clear separation between body and ball. And the rule is yes. that you have to ground the ball uh, with your upper torso, above your waist. And it's very clear that he's fallen on it with his hip. So, for me, it's not Goal a line try. Drop on try. Knock forward. Correct Goal decision being on. made there. A no try. Despite Dawnfield referees deeming that it was... Now it's available for Altaf. Lovely little pop. And at uh, that time it's Pushparaj. Oh, don't do that. Bandaranaika. Altaf leaves it for the number 25 who's come on no, in place of Vanasekara. Go back to the medium. Nothing coming, so they will come back for the penalty. Needed to launch attacks. Knowing that uh, Roy's most lethal jumper is in the bin. That was a much better strike, much more balanced. And Sean Altaf gets his first points. Ina Bradby as a 16 year old. Tenuka Fernando, love to see Lisa Naika carrying the ball a little bit more often. Almost to the line, six inches short. The penalty is coming. And the try is scored. Tisanga Lisa Naika gets the first try for Trinity College, who are making a comeback in this second half. And momentum is a very funny thing, just like Sanaka mentioned. Trinity riding on that confidence of those three points, getting the score, an all important score through their forwards. To do it around the fringes, taking on the Royal forwards. This was the earlier attempt Trinity found, were found short, just inches. Then Tisanga Disanaika picking up, good, a good, got a good connection, and referee Shankar Bacon right on spot. Well, this is what I was saying. I want to see this Anaika and make sure they clear those rocks and allow these ball carriers to do the business. Can Shan Altaf at the finishing touches? And he can. It's 10 points all, Abdella. Momentum as well and truly swung. Absolutely. And Roy have just got Buadeka Senirathna back on the field. In the territorial advantage. And similarly, Altaf playing the kicking game to Gamanayaka, who's Lost a bit of gas, he's been doing plenty of running, but not with the same amount of power that he did in the first half. Manzil immediately looking to the bench. Right in front of the post. Three points on offer. Ten all here at uh, Palekale with three minutes to go. Youngster. Got two water, kicks. Water out. Got confidence. Connects this one, absolutely no problem as Paul Le erupts in celebration. Trinity, 13 points to 10 in the lead. Two and a half minutes to go as the smoke bombs go off in the Trinity student crowd. Two and a half minutes, can Trinity hold on? Altaf straight down the middle. First roll away. Kalyana Ratna almost dropped that one but did really well to grab it back. Trinity trying to counter Ruck. Putting his body on the line once again was Danapala. Now the ball over the top. It's not a good one. 
and the ball goes into touch and That's Trinity right. have the unlikeliest of unlikely victories in the Bradby Shield encounter 13 points to 10 the identical score between BSN and Ayak and St. Thomas's yesterday and Sean Altaf stepping up under pressure and putting his team in front and Trinity College with a win that will be remembered for a long long time oh what a game absolutely terrific stuff Trinity College managing to take the Royalists by the scruff of their neck making sure that their supporters have something to cheer at well these scenes are not scenes that are familiar to Trinity College schoolboys because they have been at the receiving end of many many losses in this rugby encounter between these traditional rivals the key stats of the game Trinity College just a single try Roy scoring through but those two penalties Trinity opted to go for paying dividends at the end one converted try and two penalties for Trinity College and the man who made the difference Sean Altov the 16 year old first 5'8 of Trinity College the NDB player of the match Your embrace so warm with one more bite of revel for sunshine.